Hello everybody, my name is Mr. Kreva and welcome back to SimCity where we're having another look at Carson Shores. So in the middle here we want to get our nice coal I think it was, wasn't it coal? Ah yes, we want to start our coal industry especially because we need to supply our uh, power plant very soon as well. I mean it's uh, it's going down without anything. Oh, while we are here, actually, let's build a sign next to the road. There we go. General Electric. Not that that is in any shape or form. A little bit uh, stealing. Okay, we only need one more hour, and then we can build a coal mine. And after that, of course, we will need more money to build a trading depot. Probably going to tuck it uh, back here. Enough room to go to the exit of town and most cars so far will go to the other side anyway so a coal mine and does it really make a huge difference actually it does if we move it so over here it would be huge amounts but we do want to grab a lot so if we build it here then we can check to see and well, we cannot see as long as we don't have ac any actual money to build the enhancements. But, of course, we can build a sign on top. I'll build that one here. Probably the worst place if there's going to be more uh, of these delivery trucks, garages. First things first. Oh, what's your problem? Um, not enough freight producers. Oh, we actually do not have enough factories for the amount of uh, hmm, industry that we have. Well, actually, we have too much commerce for the industry that we have. Maybe this should give us room for four or five more factories. I think four. Yeah, four. That's good enough. Now, first things first with our coal is to actually get a trading depot up as well as a coal lot and allow them to export it as well so i think you need two or three thousand for the actual depot storage area so we'll wait one more tick before we actually build the trade depot and we'll put a coal one next to it actually it's, it might as well just put it here on this road because there isn't much coal in this particular corner anyway so and uh, yeah, that, this leaves me enough room to actually expand with some freight depots as well. What we want obviously is a coal lot here. We'll see later if you want to need anything else, but what we do want is a sign. All our buildings need to have signs. Oh, hello, here's a mountain. Oh, this looks weird. Look, I can click on the trade depot straight through the mountain. But yeah, um, let's see here, yeah, trade, import, export, company, and that's about it. Nothing else is said about it. Uh, we have four more factories going. We, uh, what do we need? We need people, do we not? Uh, things are detail. Available jobs, uh, medium wealth, unemployed, and low wealth. So we need another medium wealth area to exist. I think this might, well, might as well be the good place for that. And we'll see what happens down at the ocean level at 1.2. Of course, we will need. Uh, yeah, we can build a nature parkish here. Actually, can we only put it? Oh, okay, fine. We'll put it like this. Hopefully, this will give us enough land wealth value for these people to upgrade. Hmm. Or not? Well, we'll actually build. Uh, two of these fountains actually fountains ponds amy ponds next to it now these uh, here we have the first upgrades already going so we need some more medium wealth people in the city and you should be very close to upgrading too so that's pretty good and in the meantime we can expand our coal industry if we get one more tick of money so if you hurry up please there is a ton of coal in this region, that's for sure. 
Uh, you have more coal in this area, but you would like one on either side anyway. I mean, there is enough space to build more coal mining facilities in here anyway. So at one point we will do this. Uh, we need a fire department now. Where's the fire? Here's the... F Ooh, wow, that's a big fire. Huh. Yeah, now we need money for the fire station. 20,000 simoleons. Now we have to wait for that. Oh yeah, we were going to build some of the... Uh, uh, utilities over here that's true so well, let's see how is this guy doing of course we need to export the coal as well I remember forgetting it in the other city so well, let's see when they actually leave with the 10 ton of coal and you're almost up to full but that should be fine soon and anyway, ah, there they went and as soon as that car is back, we will get the money. Sounds good. And I've, I've been feeling a bit under the weather recently, especially today. But I think that you guys deserve these videos more than I deserve my health. Ha! Huh. No, but still, I, I do think I need to make a video, at least now that I feel well enough to do it. So, that's why uh, you get this video anyway. Okay, so the fire has actually gone out without blazing even more people. And this means that I can build the fire station in 3, 2, 1. Here it is. And we'll build it. Um, well, we want one building next to it at least. Probably the health uh, the clinic next to it. Build a sign and a flag. Once we get a, need a second garage, then I will build a alarm on top of it as well. It's not necessary for now. The town is not that big yet as well. So, we do want to expand into here. But the question is, do we want to start digging up oil as well? And, uh, I mean, yeah, I kind of ruined our chances of get, taking the oil out of the ground here. And on the other hand... The others, well, there should be enough oil in this region anyway. Every city except for Rocky Bay Ridge over there. Oh, you can actually see that's wow. When you have a map enabled, all the fog disappears, and you can actually see the outlines of the buildings. And I think this is the oil well if you look really, really closely. But yeah, um, every city except Rocky Well, Rocky Ridge, whatever it's called again. Every city has two resources, so I don't think we have to get oil out of this one anyway. They want Dr. Vu. Um, you know what I would like here is a school. So, let's see, how much is a regular ass school? 16,000. With one more tick, we're going to build a school in this town. Catch my education up. Oh, I will build it here in the middle, uh, because I do want more residential here, and that means that people can come from both sides and it's basically in the middle sort of so if we build it here it won't be too far away from the uh, um, other people I suppose so oh we want one here uh, yeah these are the bus stops for the children to go and we need one more here and now a couple down here as long as they get happy faces, it means that they can reach. So, I do believe this is already enough of it for every single kid to reach the grade school. But then again, we have 478 spots. So, we will definitely need some extra classrooms here very soon already. And they cost 8,000. Actually, didn't look. 10,000. So, once we have... Th 10,000 more simoleons we will uh, build up that as well get an extra pair of classrooms at least one for now not, we won't be able to educate everyone instantly but that's the way it goes now when to think about a regional expansion there are a lot of cool cities I do want to get another amusement park city going I mean we kind of had to cut that rural and region short and I did go back and I was able to roll back that one ghost city, but 
I think now with uh, oh waste disposal, hmm. We might have to get that one out of the way as well first before we even think about going uh, for the. Uh, huh, yeah, we'll put it here, across from the outflow pipe. Yeah, we'll have to get some uh, garbage disposal going before we think about expanding our uh, little. Uh, school there. Well, what we'll do is just dig out a bond instead and put down some classrooms on this side. Now we could build more, but first I want the sign and the flag. Makes the school look that much more cooler. And maybe an extra bus because there are a lot of people in the city. What we'll do now is actually grab some roads. Whoa! everything's turning yellow. Uh, we'll grab this uh, road here and start... Oh, we cannot do that, of course. Then we'll just make it do with it here. And make a little turn in it. And let's go down. So down this ramp, of course. And we'll just make uh, do the same as we did on the other side of uh, just one avenue going towards the edge and build all the regular roads on top of it. So here I will do the same as on the other side, uh, just on both sides. And no, I don't want it straight. If we go like this, it should be fine. And let's just continue on over here. I do want some room to fit in houses next to, in between the water, so we can always. Oh, let's keep it a little bit out of. This should be fine. Now we can build some more residential areas around here. Uh, we'll make it all the way on the outside first. Ah, this is just just barely too close to the hill to actually fit in another house. So that's too bad. But then again, that's no worry. And at the same time, let's at least build something uh, formal here in this corner. And possibly over here as well, so we get some land value increase already. And let's see, a medium park here. So we get some mansions on the coast for some high wealth people, as well as regular, well, medium wealth in the middle, on the other side as well, and a couple spaces for commercial. Not too much, because we don't want to intrude that much. Hey, apparently the amount of value has actually given us a three value boutique over here. So that's pretty cool. Um, everybody shop now. New Bix box stores. So that's probably one of these two. So we get some uh, medium wealth and a high wealth shop as well. So in here we see a low wealth area exist. Oh, we have an abandoned building because too many people are dying. Wait, where? Ah, of course, we have coal exports giving us money as well. So, how much was another shaft? That's yeah, fine. We'll build out the core coal industry at least so we can get the money from it. As well as the lever to the power plant to keep that one stocked. So, do we have 350 students enrolled in a day? Yes, we do. But we have built a new area, so we will need some extra room for to pick up kids. Mm -hmm. And one over here should be fine like this. And we'll probably very what, already not enough. It's not possible. It should have enough. Yeah, there's not that much sewage, so. So, well, we have some room here for even more commercial if we so desire. 
and more industry as well but for now let's see if we can upgrade some people's density perhaps do they want this already density well they're close to wanting here down of course not yet all of these are just uh, arrived so they don't want it either but i think we will need a clinic before we do anything else so let's save up for that people will become even happier in the town and have an actual reason to go up in density as well oh oh no it's under construction i think this is medium density actually that's pretty cool that uh, factory has been running for a while and has run it been running very well so um yeah well we can build hmm Oh, right, that's its own clinic. Well, we can build fire truck housing on the other side as well. So this should be good enough. And let's just start picking up patients, I suppose. Now, oh, this is already med well low density, not medium, but... Yeah. Get some nice uh, neighborhoods like this. And basically, this is uh, due to the way the city layout goes. I still can't upgrade you, I suppose. Not approved. Oh, you need actually need a city hall to build that sign. Oh, they are protesting. Why are you protesting? And what's the problem? Protesting, yeah, but why? Too much sewage? Oh dear. But it's all being pumped away, so I don't really see the problem. First apartment buildings. Oh, so the density here went up. Shopping and decision increases as larger shops open up, which is also good. So we actually do have some increase. But yeah, what's the problem? You have enough workers. You have enough... Well, you don't sell to neighboring cities at least. I don't want you doing that. So yeah, I think what we'll have to do is get started on another city. That is a bit easier to actually... What, what's your problem? Water shortage. Ah, that might also be a reason why pipes are backed up. So let's see, water. Ooh, we actually do not pump enough water out of the ground. So yeah, not enough water might actually be a reason for backed up pipes as well. So, huh, well, when these people are actually moving in, then we sh might be seeing an um, upgrade to City Hall. There it is. Now, what's the first building that we want? Um, we definitely want utilities to get the big sewage treatment plant and water pumping station, but there's no room in this city so I don't think that's uh, useful and education well it's not going to look like this we will have the my university town so I only don't want that as well either uh, I'll, f I'll build a sign obviously so well I guess this just has to be the regular Department of Finance and we'll build it over there now Department of Finance is pretty handy to have in a region because it allows you to change your taxes depending on the level of people of their uh, wealth so we do have available jobs as, as huh but we almost have no unemployment which is damn good but we do have a lot of unsatisfied shoppers then again we have that little bit of unemployment building too many commercial buildings will actually make it go up again so each wealth level individually so we'll do it like this in this city make it more attractive for high wealth and a little less for medium for low wealth so we have more medium wealth in the end what's your uh, deal already upgraded you so industrial density ooh, many medium density already that's pretty good and uh, sewage is still backed up pipes yeah now we're getting to the point where there's too much sewage for uh, one pipe to actually help out so we'll probably have to build a second outflow pipe and we'll build it there 
Now it should divide between the two and get rid of most of the sewage in the city. And make everyone happy. Happy, happy, happy. So what do we have here? Um, ooh, medium wealth. Sewage backing up was annoying, so it will become better again. And, oh, wow, we actually have some traffic problems here. So I will upgrade to low density streets and it's basically it doubles the lane capacity but doesn't upgrade the capacity for uh, anyone's buildings to upgrade so it's so uh, win-win for our city because it will alleviate the traffic problem in those areas where it uh, is an issue so we'll uh, upgrade it everywhere uh, oh here's actually a very huh that's interesting. There's a lot of traffic over there. But it's also possible it gets uh, automatically fixed and there should always be some traffic after they come home from shopping. So it should dissolve instant itself after some time. Yeah, now they want some... Uh, hmm. We can actually build Vu Tower. I thought it... Uh, and Max's Manor, but that's not going to be here. Oh, did I just see some criminals? They just went here for shoplifting. <gasps> you guys are so bad. Yeah, we'll need a police station very soon. Build it close to the school. Uh, keep that one more central. Fire trucks can get everywhere fast, I hope. And the worst case scenario, we'll build another fire station over here. Actually, it looks pretty cool. We'll uh, have city hall like this. Don't you think this looks nice? You can see Rocky Way Ridge. That's the one, I think, in the background here. Burton of yeah, too much crime. That was what I was going to fix right now, so... Hold you horses. And we have a police station. Need to get those criminals arrested. That should be good. Uh, crime is actually the only thing worrying people in this town right now. Hmm. Townhouses. Oh, that would be medium wealth, medium density. Oh, hello. This one is going to be medium wealth, medium density housing. That's pretty... Uh, we're going up in this city, and it's simply doing simple stuff, like just building the city out and you will you probably want another one of those shafts do you not so we build one here and let's see 10,000 oh, one more shaft and this will be at maximum capacity coal mine and we'll make the most money out of it as we can Five, oh the amount of freight has gone down with the new update, I think. It used to be 16.2 crates, now it's only 5.4. But it's a lot more important because of the changes they did to the RCI, so... Yeah. It's, uh, it's actually helpful, I th suppose. And you can actually transport it out to other cities and not ne that you will not need industry in those cities then. Um, let's see, this is mercantile, making us happy. So yeah, well, we could upgrade these densities. I don't really like to do that. These might upgrade into um, medium density at one point. Ah, here it is. Pinecrest Apartments. Medium density. Oh, medium wealth. Might actually build some medium wealth here and have the same happen on the other side. What's the issue? Ooh, classrooms are full indeed. So let's build a top classroom there and an extra school bus. I don't think that's necessary just yet. We'll see that uh, when they pick up everyone. Land value might be going to medium density as well. So yeah, oh, they want a shuttle depot. Yeah, I do want some public transportation as well in this city. That should be fine. It costs 20,000 though. And you need a few more thousand for the bus stops everywhere. So we will wait it out. 
in the meantime let's have another look at how city hall is situated so beautifully this is actually very damn funky to watch and they're not protesting anymore so we're working <laughs> the city is working but yeah this region is pretty damn beautiful with such a lake and I hear the uh, sirens in the background so the view of the city here you have our coal mine our power plant I hear gunshots in the background as well uh, so time to build a shuttle bus depot and uh, we'll build it over here uh, makes have some space we, we can't always expand for more residential here in the middle which is what I do want to do so let's see one here one here and here doesn't actually sh whoa is that more apartment buildings that's pretty damn funny to see uh, one over here actually and I guess there and here and some down here Now, don't want to have everyone walk too far to get to a bus stop. So they don't actually have to. Uh, and that, that way one bus stop won't fill up very high. And get one next to the clinic because people will take the bus to the clinic if they can. So we can also build a park and ride. And that's basically useful in such a community. So you can build a park and ride here. So basically everyone should least the way they should work they would ride to they take their own car to the park and ride and then set up for the then take the bus from that point what we will do before signing off is build two more shuttle bus depots and maybe if we get some money quick enough we can build an extra classroom as well because again we are almost enrolling everyone but we're not enrolling everyone. Did I have? Yes, I do have bus uh, stops for the kids everywhere, so that's good. And we will have another uh, classroom as well as a bus for the kids. So here we go. This will be the end of this episode of SimCity. Carson Shores is expanding quite nicely and I do have to say the view from City Hall is quite damn beautiful. It uh, was a good choice building it here. And for now we can only see Rocky Way Ridge in the background. But uh, in a couple of episodes there should be more cities popping up everywhere as well. And yeah, that will uh, end this video. Make sure to like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to the channel for more amazing content coming out. And I will see you later.